for the next 48. I did a pre-shuffle. Let's get right to the reading. We have the Eight of Cups in reverse. The Hermit. Nine of Cups. King of Cups. That's your energy, Scorpio. Ten of Wands. Two of Swords. The Devil. Three of Wands in reverse. All right, Eight of Cups in reverse. There's some kind of silver lining here from a situation that you walked away from. Some kind of te temporary good thing. Silver lining is really more the Five of Cups, but this is this is some kind of temporary situation that's going to be really good for you because of a discovery you made. And it's going to lead to wish fulfillment. Except I'm confused, why is this temporary? Why is this temporary if it's going to lead to wish fulfillment? The sun. I think it just really makes you really happy, at least for a little while. I almost feel like this might be like some kind of beauty regimen, like you might get Botox or filler and it makes you really happy, you know, at least for the time being, for however long it lasts. And it, it's going it's going to be just what you needed. Yeah, King of Cups. And it might even it might even help give you the confidence to pursue a romantic interest. But now you kind of have this anxiety about like, how can I keep this up? Like, you know, whatever this is that came in is temporary. And how are you going to continue to have this confidence to pursue? It doesn't even necessarily have to be a romantic interest that you're pursuing, but something that you love. You're pursuing something that you love and you want to keep going with it, even though you know whatever this gift was, was temporary. And you know, in order to continue that, you're going to have to make some tough choices. You run the risk of falling back on some old habits. That was my dog, sorry. You run the risk of falling back on some old habits in order to continue this confidence up. Like say the confidence has to do with like, you know, something social, right? you might start drinking more in order to keep this going. But I think this is a warning here. The devil card and the three of wands in reverse together. I think this is a warning. I mean, not to do that because it's not going to lead, it's not going to lead to what you want. We have the emperor card. You will find a better way. You really have to put in the work. You will find the better way to expand upon whatever this temporary blessing was to make it a long-term thing. You'll, you'll find the resources that you need. We have the 10 of swords in reverse. And the two of wands. Yeah. Once you, you're going to find a way to get what you need but it's going to be a lot more difficult. It's not going to be like the blessing that you had in the past. There's going to be prep work involved just to get the confidence you need in order to pursue the thing you love. So this thing that you're pursuing is becoming a lot more involved, but you're going to continue, like this is where you're going to be by the end of the next 48 hours is you're going to be kind of contemplating how to make this work for you. Like there are avenues and there are resources you just have to contemplate on how to make this work for you and whether or not it's going to be personally worth it to you to pursue. I mean, I always think that with the two of wands, I always think taking the chance and going out in the world is always the better option, but that's gonna be up to you. All right, see you later.